good morning i am in hawaii um i'm whispering because phil's still sleeping it's seven in the morning i'm very crusty i'm about to go brush my teeth wash my face and go to the gym i keep waking up early because my body is still not used to hawaiian time it's five hours behind so really in boston it's 12 p.m yeah so originally we weren't gonna vlog just because we wanted to relax um and i just felt like there was not a lot of content that i could film but you know what a lot of you guys were mentioning that you wanted me to share my resort my experiences um where we were going and all that stuff so i was like you know what why not vlog and i'm just not used to it i'm not used to carrying cameras out in public and just being like what's up you guys but i just feel like it'll be fun it'll be an experience so yes we are staying in manalani resort it is on the big island i from the drive from the airport to here was literally all like rocks because those are all i don't know if this is the right word all old magma from the volcano so it's literally just like black everywhere it's just flat but it's very beautiful it's only a 30 minute drive but we rented a car you get out of the airport and it's just you go down one highway the entire way for 25 minutes and you just arrive um it's absolutely beautiful i'm in love with this resort i was freaking out yesterday or two days ago when we arrived because the first thing you freaking know your girl the first thing I went to was the gym. It's a dream. I don't know why they didn't advertise their gym. I saw like, you know, photos of the hotel and their picture of the gym was just like a couple machines and a treadmill. So I was like, oh, okay, it's just a standard gym. What? There's like an outdoor part to the gym. I'll show you guys. You guys are gonna die. It's insane. Okay, another common question that I kept getting asked was how I was traveling? Um, in the continental u.s were there any restrictions or anything like that so we had to test negative before we got here and the test result can't be anything longer than three hours three hours what <laughs> anything longer than three days we had to take the rapid test which was pricey it was 200 dollars per person and then when you land you have to take they test you again at the airport so they swab you and they contact you if you test positive and if you do test positive you are quarantined in your hotel room you cannot leave it which does suck but I felt safe that they tested us here and also required us to test negative before we got here so I just I just feel extra safe if that makes sense so I'm gonna get started for the day and I'll talk to you guys later Alright, there is currently no one at the gym, so I'm going to do a quick gym tour. There is a very cute looking face here. <laughs> There's an outdoor part. I'm obsessed with this gym. Going to be doing most of my workouts out here. And then there's an indoor part with a ton of Peloton bikes at the bikes. My British chef, I was just like, there's a ton of pilot and bikes, the back, ellipticals, treadmill, and more weightlifting section. How excited was I for this gym, Phil? Very excited. Like, how excited You're though? Freaking out. <laughs> I could not sleep that night. I'm going to do a quick back day and film it, and Phil's gonna ditch me. I'll be filming it actually. Yeah, he'll be coming back to film me. All right. So this is his first time shaving <laughs> in like in, my whole life. <laughs> in like a month and a half. I'm so happy. I personally like a clean shave. Mm -hmm. All right, so I just got back from my massage. This morning, um, I normally wouldn't do massage when I'm away on vacation, but because of my lower back, um, I needed one. Now I'm gonna get changed. We're gonna go eat breakfast, then off to the beach. So we is off. To Boston, you want, you don't want to be in there. <laughs> no. So we're off to breakfast. Um, so a lot of people have been asking, like, what's it like 
in our resort and we do have to wear a mask whenever we go somewhere once we're at the beach we can take it off um, same thing as like Boston you went sure that you did for breakfast for food once the drink is out you can take it off but yeah Okay, so this is a felgot. What is it? Salmon and bagels. Mm -hmm. And this is what I got prosciutto with poached eggs. Oh, this looks so good. And I got the green machine smoothie and some coffee. My biggest regret is not bringing the protein coffee on the trip. <laughs> so, when we got here, uh, we went to the resort restaurant and <laughs> I ordered a Wagyu beef <laughs> and I feel stupid <laughs> because <laughs> the waitress said, mm. well, what did the waitress say? It was $30 an ounce. Yeah, she said $30 an ounce for the Wagyu beef and I understood it as $30 per three ounces. So I ordered five ounces thinking it's going to be like Because in the bucks. sentence before that, she said the smallest serving they'll do is three thirty dollars so then i was like oh yeah like i'll get five ounces that'll be fine and i got an appetizer because i was like fifty dollars you know it's expensive but it's not as expensive so i got an appetizer and a dessert and the total came out to be four hundred dollars i almost passed out and phil was like oh it's because of the wagyu beef you got it, it's fine it's like five ounces yeah so it's gonna be pretty expensive i was like why she said it's thirty dollars my steak was so stinking good like i was i was dying over it but it was 150 dollars just for the steak it's like about the price it was in japan yes but i wouldn't have gotten it if it was if i knew it was 150 dollars oh this breakfast is so much better than yesterday's this is really good i'm glad that i didn't get the same one so you like your breakfast from yesterday i love that and I was gonna get it every day, but. I love you. Okay, so this is trending on TikTok, so I'm gonna try something. I'm gonna show you something. Hold on, real quick before we go to the pool. So I saw this trending on TikTok, so I wanted to show this to Phil. I'm gonna show you how tampons work. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's this tiny. Did you know it looks like this? Mm -hmm. Did you know it was a small? Mm -hmm. Okay, have you ever seen a tampon? Like mm -hmm. inside of it? Mm -hmm. Okay, so here's water, right? Because mm -hmm. when you're on your period, it gets wet, right? Mm -hmm. So you put it in like this. Mm -hmm. Hold on. And you push it. And you just kind of pull this out. Because you know, it gets that thick. Mm -hmm. Your reaction is so boring. What? What am I supposed to do? Scream? <laughs> It's so scary, it's a tampon! It's gonna kill me! <laughs> no, but isn't this crazy that like this giant I mean, thing... it's interesting. Alright, so that was very uneventful. Hope you guys like that prank. More cool it's videos coming prank. soon. It was a <laughs> trending video I wanted to try on you. <laughs> the lobby level is just so beautiful. We're about to go to town now. This is what I'm wearing. This is a Moxie bra from, from Balance that is launching at the end of this month. Got this purse from Amazon. But yeah, we're about to go to town. Woo! All right, so we just tried to get some content photos for Balance in this outfit. Um, and now we're heading into town. Are you excited? Mm-hmm. <laughs> How excited? Very excited. Alright, so we were on our way to go eat, 
But then he saw a sign that said scenic point and he literally turned right so fast. <laughs> It is quite scenic. It is very pretty. It's like, damn. Okay, so we just got back for um, uh, our dinner. Um, we didn't end up exploring the city because it was very late and we decided to um, just have dinner. I ended up having Korean food, which was a <laughs> nice surprise. But Angelica sent me some Toluca pieces for me um, because I told her I will be in Hawaii and she sent me some more swimsuit. So excited. This is the cheetah print, which is a Felis, Felis, Felis pattern um, with a matching bottom. This is a GM Maxi, which is a higher waisted of the Leopardus. And then this, I believe, is a cover up, which I've been excited to try. Anyways, going to sleep, and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow.